That was a COVID. Wow, well, anyway. So anyway, I hope everybody is doing well. By the way, my name is DJ UK. Hey, hey, DJ UK. I started by way with a Tekko Kickstarter the early hour. So I will quite say great at night or tomorrow. It's a other way to yet to do that. It to do with a great tomorrow. It's it time it night right now. So, yeah. So it does the end mid now. Let's see here to make grid on. So do it has a CDAA. Start you with it. A. 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 But they did it was about side 10. Hold on. They called they had a critical about that thing, but I did a wait, what did why? What take it to ten? Oh what what quit or do quit? Okay, I quite ah. Take them away. You know, it ain't it. It work. It ain't it. Where do the dark come? Okay. Eh, eh, it is a day why I quit the wet dough. Do do. Do play quick away block why. But the day I'll always why I quit. We're really excited to share some news on those and um, and a few more chances for us to share uh, some great news. Go it on the way. You know, we just want to uh, always give you guys the updates of the games that we're working on and. Uh, that you guys will tune into this uh, spotlight and to other uh, showcases and spotlights in the future. Um, so let's start with the first game, uh, Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection. Um, Kellen, I know uh, you've been working on a ton of Mega Man games throughout your career. So yep. <laughs> yeah, give us, give us the rundown on, on what we can expect. Yeah, so Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection, as the name suggests, it's a collection of 10 games. Uh, ranging from the first game all the way through the sixth game. So that includes the different variations, starting with, uh, starting with three. Uh, so, basically, you have the entire storyline. It is kind of like one unified storyline. Oh, what do you tell you? What do you die? Together in a really nice package that includes mm -hmm. like some additional features, like online and uh, basically online net battling and chip trading as well. Yeah, Rune B, Susie, um, have you guys had a chance to play any of the games? In go here, go. Not Battle Network. It'll be totally new to me, but the combat <laughs> system is definitely interesting. Yeah, I've only ever played the classic X and Legend series, so like Battle Network. It's always like been on the horizon for me, but I've never really uh, gotten into it. So I'm actually <laughs> excited to check it out. This is our so. chance. Yeah, this yeah. is our chance. <laughs> and it's all of them. It's yeah. 10 games. It's a yeah. lot. Yeah. 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 That is so <laughs> cool. Yeah, I love that. I feel like there's so many Mega Man games that you, in our, are in collections at this point. It's just yeah. yeah. Go. Go. Like, 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 we are dead. Uh, that just we are that the five seed one a new um, metal map like by new metal map right? battle uh, network uh, day who uh, uh, a we master so yeah bombs, basically things that can maybe shoot straight forward um you know bombs that kind of go overhead you can even actually like get the net navi information from other net navis which are like the little care basically the kind of like your avatar in the virtual world if you will um basically use them and bring them into battle as well so you're not only moving around in this grid, but you're constantly thinking about how to how to use your different battle chips 
to basically kind of navigate battles, delete viruses, and beat you know your opponents. So there's a lot of depth to the combat. It's kind of fun. Yeah, I, I like the strategy aspect of it a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, next title, Ghost Trick Phantom Detective. Just announced it last month, so um, you know people don't have to wait too long to play it. Um, <laughs> Rumbi, you actually said that you, you played this uh, the, the game before. I did. I played it for the first time last year, and it just it blew me away. I loved it from the get-go, <laughs> and I'm so excited for more people to actually play it as well. Um, yeah, I, I just, the entire time playing it, all the detective stuff, the animations, the characters, just where have you all been my whole life? <laughs> <laughs> and I, unfortunately, have never played it. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to checking it out, because, yeah. yeah, it's always been a title that all my friends have... Uh, told me to play, so. I think you'll love it. Yeah, <laughs> I think I will too. The animations look amazing, so. Yeah, I mean, your chance is coming up, so. <laughs> yes, I will take it. <laughs> but yeah, like, it's it's a game written by Shu Takumi, uh, so a lot of people may already recognize that name from the Ace Attorney series. Uh, so he was also the writer for Ghost Trick Phantom Detective. Um, so if you love Ace Attorney, you're not going to want to miss this. Uh, really fun, engaging story. Really amazing characters. Uh, you know, there's a really great opportunity for you know this going from kind of like a niche title to something that's coming to a lot more platforms. You know, it's a really great opportunity to jump into it. Yeah. And if you like Pomeranians, one's the main character. That's true. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> missile the Pomeranian. Yeah. 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 Now I have to play it. <laughs> uh, let's jump over to Exo Primal, um, game we haven't seen for a little bit. Um, we we did announce this back in 2022. Um, Kellen, I know you've been working on this game. Um, dinosaur action kind of says it all. It's just it's looking pretty awesome. So tell us yeah. uh, tell us a little bit more about the game. Yeah. So if you're not familiar, Exo Primal it is a five v five team based PVE and PVP shooter slash action game. There's lots to unpack there, uh, but I'll try to make it simple. So <laughs> basically, you're being thrown into these various war games uh, run by this the like, you know kind of mad AI named Leviathan. You're constantly being thrown in with other players, but the way it works is you're constantly given new missions each time as Leviathan kind of gives you new new strategies and things that you have to enact. So uh, basically you're you're working with these other players, uh, trying to basically cut through and fight through different hordes of dinosaurs, uh, ultimately you know, either resulting in a head-to-head -head match with another team at the very end to kind of determine who's going to win, or there might be some other outcomes, uh, which we saw in the uh, previous closed beta test, or closed network test, I should say. Yeah, B, have you had a chance to, to check out X-Primal at all? I haven't yet, unfortunately. Yeah, I haven't either, but... By the way, I'm walking in on my Nintendo Quiz, but D, the wet dog in the bow. If you're not feeling Get the you it by now. that you're currently using, you can actually switch through to kind of like so, a yeah. turn one. You run around as a pilot for a second, but then you can actually just summon in another one, take on that suit. Oh, let you turn my Nintendo down. Yeah, I love the sound of that because there's so many to other audio, multiplayer to one more time, to that it, don't allow you to do that. So when you like get wiped as a that, like as a unit, you can just you know you don't have to wait for a whole new match. You yeah. can just do it on the spot. <laughs> yeah, I think Kellen, um, you know, you, you said it before. If you if you like the kind of action games that that okay. Capcom makes, that's really it's really it's way down with, um, with, with some of the stuff that we made in the past. I mean, so I yeah, games. I got uh, very. Devil May Cry vibes. I think there's a lot of Capcom DNA in Exo Primal, and that's what makes me excited for it. Um, you know, you mentioned you know, kind of the, the Virgil suit as it was in the Zephyr. Uh, you see a lot of that feeling from you know, a lot of other Capcom franchises across the suits. Yeah, from what I've seen so far, it kind of reminds me. You are honor here to watch all your by doctor on my <laughs> end. Yeah, moving on for Exo Primal. Um, Obviously, I think the one that we're all super, super excited for, Resident Evil 4. Speaking of greatest hits. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, it, it's coming out in just a few short weeks. Um, and, you know, we've, we've shown quite a bit at this point. Um, in our most recent trailer, I think there was just a ton in there. There was, you know, battling through the castle with Luis, and you're seeing him in places that you haven't seen him in. There's a Krauser fight. There's just tons of crazy action, so, you know. And they're all a right now. Uh, I mean, Luis is definitely the biggest surprise in the last trailer. Um, and they get so to hang out and 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 actually develop this chemistry. So, yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like, not surprised to see him. It's just shocking to see, yeah. like, Luis fight enemies that he never looks at in the original, you know, <laughs> like, that you just have to do by yourself. But now you have a, a pal. You got a buddy. It's really cool. <laughs> it's like, I just, I just want to see that connection grow more, because it definitely felt a little more mysterious than the original, mm -hmm. but I feel like we're going to get way more out of that character yeah. uh, in particular. Probably just everyone. Like, I mean, yeah. even Ashley has, like, 
this so much more of a expanded role this time around uh, based on what we've seen you know her and Leon are very veiny looking yeah uh, <laughs> in a lot of those cutscenes <laughs> like actually feels like they're gonna struggle to survive this time and not just, really just a little bit of infection yeah, you know? yeah just a little bit not <laughs> just shake it off like, yeah like, okay whatever like yeah, I think that was one of the questions with the when we first revealed Resident Evil 4 of, you know, it's got this really dark tone that you expect from something like RE2 uh, and RE3, but then is the action still there? Is the atmosphere and, and kind of like the... The what do you want to bet an attack called the rest of the day? It's all in there. Yeah, the it's suplex. there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> got the one-liners. Yep. <laughs> suplex, crazy parries. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Roundhouse kicks, like just... Yeah. Amazing. It, it just looks so, like so much fun, and it looks <laughs> very replayable too. Like I think there was um, some stealth uh, gameplay shown off, like you know, or maybe hinted at with some mm. of the weapons and just actions that Leon can take. You know, I saw him crouch in a house one time, and I was just like, oh wow, you could probably you know approach <laughs> situations differently. Mm. Yeah. Like to agree to a degree that you just couldn't in the original. Yeah, I mean, in, in terms of those actions, uh, you'll, this will. But you've already seen this one now, but I can see this. <laughs> and because, uh, but do we have the knife fairy as well? I knew uh, I went so with, with a new I went with uh, either we don't ball. Wanna, we don't want to spoil too that much. That kind of in a bit. Uh, Leon is very at the Kaido. Is that? Mother <laughs> Ito. Father had to buy. Mmm. We got Mother Man. Father Nako Weathery. And everybody went to pay. And uh, oh wait, we dark team minded really ten minutes to do the dog who went up his knife like chains yeah. down on him. Yeah. We um, we are dead more than a way. Exclusive RE4 YouTuber. Yeah, pretty much. But pair of are yo. You heard it here first. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we'd, be, we'd be remiss if we didn't talk about the Krauser fight. Oh, yeah. Just being able to uh, have those QTEs now, you're actually parrying in real time. It's, yes. Yeah. Yes. It's rewarding but you for all the parries right, that you right. do in the earlier part of the game. It's actually training you for the Krauser fight. Yeah. It's, yeah I, I love this. It's genius design. It's genius. So, kinetic, uh, oh, oh, but it, yeah, Leon's, Leon's got experience. Death, there, right? so, yeah. Yeah. Yes. death. Do but but even he falters when Krauser Anyway, we did 10 minutes. The red dot at the red. The the red dot at just at at about eight that nine minute by now. Monster Hunter. That's right. So the red box by Quero. We're kicking it over to a couple of trailers for just recently uh for recent titles. So yeah, yeah. Countdown's still going. Um, you know what we're seeing right now is just the the most recent update um that we just released for Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. Um, Vilcana, which we revealed. Um, Kellen, I know you're you're at Capcom during the Iceborne yep. <laughs> World era, so um, that was a big one. Yeah, big fan of Vilcana. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> or my Vilcana like jacket to work every day. Yeah, and yeah, and your your plumage hat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've we've released a ton of updates for uh, for Sunbreak so far. Um, so this was the fourth update, and we've got the fifth one coming uh, in the future. So we're, we're pretty excited about that. Just just a ton of content and. We just keep adding like the most hardest monsters possible, and then people post clips about how they got destroyed, which um, you know, personally I, I laugh at every time. So keep sending them. <laughs> or how they spent like tons of time learning how to destroy it. Yeah, yeah. Which is you know, that's really cool too. Yeah. My favorite thing so far is every time we release these updates, um, like I see a new move from some monster that like I've never seen before, and I'm just like, that's in there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So many surprises for Monster Hunter. Yeah, that's what's so cool about yeah. it. It's like there's so much replayability, you know, for every single fight <laughs> in yeah, the game, yeah. in all of these games. Like, so every experience is so unique to the player. Yeah. Hey, there's my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I love yeah, and we, uh, well, it's coming up on screen, but we, <laughs> these, these guys. Oh, nice. Um, <laughs> oh, wow. That's so cute. I do like these designs a lot. They're just yeah. so, they're so over the top. Yeah. Yeah. I think there's an art form in making something like very detailed, but like not at the same time. That's, what I, that's actually what I love <laughs> yeah. about Capcom's games is that like you guys are so like okay with just being like, here's RE2, but also 1999 <laughs> version, you know, sorry, 98 version yeah, of Leon. Yeah. It's this big block man running around. Like. <laughs> yeah, and on screen we've got one more update coming in, uh, in April, so look for, for news on that uh, in the near future. Um, 
But yeah, yeah, Monster Hunter, um, there's just been so much content for it, people playing for hundreds of hours. Um, so I want, I want to ask you guys, like, what, you, what is your most played Capcom game? Oh, I can tell you it's uh, RE1 Remake. <laughs> mm. that's, that's also my favorite game, just in general, so. Really? I'd say between one remake or two remake at this point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How, how many hours would you estimate? So I would I would have to include like back when it came out on GameCube with like the HD version like probably just thousands of hours. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, it's my favorite game. So yeah, I definitely don't have thousands of hours, yeah. but yeah. quite a few. Yeah. I don't think um, I have thousands of hours either. It's okay. Yeah, it's, <laughs> I played it a lot, but not quite it's that one of much. My, it's yeah. one of my favorites. So. I think the first time I saw the Resident Evil One remake, I. I was just like, graphics can't get better than this. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's like it's impossible. <laughs> I remember the, when it first came out, I was like showing one of my friends, and he thought what I was playing was still the cutscene, oh, like wow. the opening cutscene. <laughs> and I was like, no, I've been playing for like 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. First time I played, I was just too scared because it looked yeah, so yeah. real. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Like I had nightmares about Definitely. RE1. And RE4, which, I mean, in hindsight, maybe it's not as scary as I yeah. thought, but you know. It's an intense game. Yeah. Yeah. The intro's intense. Yeah. yeah. Like, you don't know where you are, people are attacking you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, so, actually, it's coming to mind now uh, with Capcom Arcade Stadium and Second Stadium. What was the earliest Capcom game? Was that Sansan Son that was just on screen? That was Sansan. Son, oh my yeah. god, I haven't played Sansan <laughs> Son in so long. <laughs> um, the, the very first video game I ever played was actually. Um, uh, Street Fighter 2 on oh, wow. uh, SNES, okay. yeah, and uh, I played as Cammy, and I fell in love <laughs> right then and there. But yeah, that's probably like the earliest um, Capcom game I played. Okay. I want to say no, yeah, I want to say Street Fighter is definitely one of the earliest. Yeah, yeah. I I like knew Capcom games before I even knew what Capcom was, basically. Yeah. <laughs> like I always yeah. see this logo as a kid, yeah. like what's Capcom? Yeah, what does that mean? <laughs> yeah. I learned what developers were. Yeah. yeah. I think it's Street Fighter 2 for me too. Yeah. Yeah. That's classic. Yeah. How about you, think, Yeah, I mean, it might have been, I was like, like, real small kid. It might have been Ghost and Goblins in an arcade once. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, like, it was an older machine, uh, but I still think that might have been one of the earliest. Yeah. I actually remember playing Forgotten Worlds on the Genesis. Wow, yeah. Wow. That was way back when. Yeah, way but, for sure, <laughs> yeah. Um, that might have been one of the earliest ones for me, honestly. Uh, that and Mercs. Mercs is a big one that I really liked. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if that was like the first one I played, but it's I got fun memories. Yeah. So let me ask you guys. Logo reveals. Resident Evil 7 or Village? Which seven. one was more shocking? Seven. <laughs> seven. <laughs> yeah. you just, it came out of nowhere yeah. and it blew everyone's mind. Yeah, it just, because like the game that they show up before that is right. like so different to what yeah. just everything that we've played in RE. <laughs> so it was like, that's Ari? Yeah. Like what? Like that's Resident Evil? <laughs> right. My favorite thing. <laughs> it's back. Yeah. And there hadn't been like a, a mainline game mm -hmm. in a in a hot minute. So it was like, it was like five years. really surprising. Yeah. Because you just see the seven and you're like, I don't know what this game is, but it looks yeah. great. Yeah. And then Resident Evil. By oh. the time Village came along, it was kinda like we were trained by seven. So yeah. we were like, this could be Seven was so right, right. This could be a Resident Evil game. Yeah. <laughs> just like the yeah. way it's it's like hidden in the logo, I'm like, that's changed. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah, who thought of that? Yeah. Yeah. Like even the you know, even the Japanese version, you know, Biohazard, uh, the seven is in the Z. That's right, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. true, yeah. I, mean, I have to play totally. the you know, I have to play the fifth on this one because they're both they're both my children. I love them both equally. I've worked on both campaigns. So I can't I can't select my favorite here. Yeah, yeah. That's understandable. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough, yeah. Very understandable. Yes. <laughs> I mean, eight's great too, because you just think, you know, like how how did they find the eight or the yeah the eight in <laughs> right. the yeah. village? Yeah, it's just and such it a takes perfect place in a village. Like, yeah, it's, it's such a perfect series of events. It is to unfold for this game, for this beautiful, beautiful game. Look, look how nice it looks. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, third yeah, you know what? I I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna miss the Wintrusses. They were they were they were fun. They were fun characters, you know. Like, yeah, I enjoyed them. Yeah. Anything can happen in this series. That Good. is true. Yeah. <laughs> but yes, I will, I will miss them too. I will miss yeah. Them. <laughs> Got very attached to Ethan and Eight. Speaking of being attached, you can oh, no. really can be, be Ethan <laughs> in Resident Evil Village VR. <laughs> <laughs> but what I think yeah. that is something I would like to not 
Sorry about that guy. <laughs> I went to the back real quick. And we got yeah, nine yeah, minutes to the rest. Get that on the way. I need to unattach this headset. So, what the advice to those who went to in on Facebook and right here on Twitch? So, I went to get a red help. I went to. I went to uh, ask the boat to read that, we read that about sticky decades of wet that anyway. Like, it's everything but, so, like, like, take a mile. Big a great aqua. Yeah. Uh, 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 it went to the great aqua. So, it went to the aqua. Uh, and, <laughs> At uh, 1 a.m. at the round 12 30 a.m. in the time, 9 day to pick it. Death to the well, forward. So much you can do with this. I've had, had a chance to play just so, a little bit. Uh, hold the last day with the off at 1 30, no, 12 30 a.m. at the great ice world. Death to the well, forward, and trade day day. But anyway! But God will make her do the cry really to <laughs> my <laughs> new <laughs> one quit <laughs> our <laughs> side <laughs> channel. Yeah, it always are now, so it always are. So yeah, it went with anyway. Die! Four, three, two, one, and that that you die. Attack on the hook, attack on the spark right to the stress, and on the way. Hello everyone! Welcome to Capcom Spotlight, where we'll provide updates on our upcoming games. Stay tuned until the end to hear the latest on all of Capcom's new titles. Without any further delay, here's the first okay, game. Okay, but uh... Ooh, no matter Madam what, Man, Battle and Battle? Metal Man Battle Mega Man Battle Network with the Red and Red to crack the game. It's coming out today after my birthday. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection launches April 14th, 2023. Lan and his net navvy Mega Man.exe work together to solve countless cyber crimes in the real world as well as the interconnected online cyber world. Add battle chips to your chip folder to use in combat as you battle viruses on the net. Select multiple chips of the same type and code each turn to create powerful combinations. We seem to be getting a message from director Masakazu Iguchi, aka Mr. Famous. Battle routine, set, execute. Hello everyone, it's Mr. Famous. I'm excited to share the latest Battle Network news with you all. First, check out this video. Heaven Aquila. A party cracker of your heart. Anonymous by Christmas. We are the first kind kind of cracker. I was to die. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection includes all 499 patch cards from Battle Network 4 onward that were available only in Japan as physical cards. In Battle Network 4, 5, and 6, players can enable or disable patch cards. Buster Max Mode multiplies the Mega Buster's damage by 100, letting oh, cool. players enjoy the story and speed up combat. You can turn this feature on or off at any time during the story, based on how you want to play. Oh, cool. And don't worry, Buster Max Mode is automatically turned off for online okay, we had all of That's all I have for you today. I've been Mr. Famous. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Famous. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection includes over 1,000 illustrations and 188 music tracks to enjoy in the gallery. 
With online play, players can connect with distant friends and rivals to trade battle chips and net battle too. Pre-orders are available now. Mega Man Battle Network Legacy Collection brings all 10 mainline games to Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4, and Steam. Volume 1 and Volume 2 will also be available at launch. Starting March 21st, the English version of Mega Man NT Warrior will be available to watch for free. Check the official website for more information. Oh, oh there was a Mega Man anime? Oh wow, anyway, a new era of fighting with games is upon us. us. Okay. Here I go. Street Fighter 6 launches June 2nd, 2023. This is the latest edition of the series that redefined the genre. In addition to Fighting Ground, where the pinnacle of genre-defining battles take place, Street Fighter VI includes World Tour, an immersive single-player story mode, and Battle Hub, an online social space reminiscent of arcades. There are a number of new ways to play beyond just fighting. Today we'll introduce the final color commentator included in the game. Please enjoy this video. What the end? Oh, can we? Japanese actress Hikaru Takahashi is joining the fray, bringing our lineup of play by play and color commentators to a total of eight. Real-time commentary matches the in-game action and brings the competitive thrill and excitement straight to your home. Subtitles for real-time commentary will be supported we, we in 13 time. languages. Turn on rally support and the commentators will cheer you on, creating a more personal experience. Street Fighter 6 launches on PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S, and Steam on June 2nd, 2023. Pre-orders are now available along with a limited number of pre-order bonuses. See the official website for details. You were dead we'll have dead. more Street Fighter 6 updates what at a later date. We will have pre oh, update. Capcom Pro Tour 2023 invites players around the world to compete to be the best. All right, you ready? We're also proud to announce the 2023 season will feature Street this Fighter year, X. This year, it has to great subscribers. There will be a special year, prize package this season. This year, Kirby has Capcom three Fighter X. We'll receive one million dollars. The total prize pool for the season will be over two million dollars. Next, we'd like to share some exciting Capcom Not news. Out. Capcom celebrates its 40th anniversary this June. As this part of the celebration, with the we're opening a digital theme park, park called Capcom Town. We're planning to construct a digital museum and other buildings. The grand opening is June 12, 2023. Please see this link for the latest.
A Capcom ID account is required to play Resident Evil RE-verse, Exoprimal, and use the online features of Street Fighter VI. Uh, oh, oh, all right. You can use this account with other Capcom services and campaigns, such as a survey about today's Capcom Spotlight. We'll release more titles and services compatible with Capcom ID soon. Register now for Capcom ID. Futuristic exosuits and dinosaurs class in Exoprimal. Okay, with the Escada crew now. With the Escada now. team-based action game. Players suit up as exofighters who work for the IBS Corporation. Use a variety of unique exosuits and rigs to fit your playstyle and work with teammates to combat hordes of dinosaurs in Dino Survival. Let's take a look at the latest trailer. We have some surprises in store, so be sure to watch to the end. What, but and dare we? In every war game, Ace really is getting pulled back three years into the past. Back to 2014, right before the Stradivader fails. <laughs> You're a time traveler. This is no random outbreak. Leviathan is intentionally summoning them as cannon fodder for the war game. But why? Why repeat the same day over and over? Chief? And exactly did you say your sister passed? Yeah. One of the first outbreaks. Never found out more than that. You know how the Chief network Haruka was. Lorenzo. She is alive. In the island. In the past. Another exo fighter recruit. Oh, right. what? Oh, wait, Welcome Connie? Connie. Oh, wait, it's a Connie. And, and, and it's Connie. The rifle. It's a quick old boy. Fuck now. So, oh, we thought it was it with it as well. Okay. Uh, the dead today, and we got a battle pass. Parker Queen attached to the world. So they took you a day one with a bar game pass. What did you think? We had a lot of new info, including the release date. Let's go over it in detail. Right, no tea to tie. Exo Primal launches on July 14th. Before that, we'll be holding an open beta test. So, in addition uh, okay. to the exosuits we've previously introduced, the two new suits in today's trailer will also be playable in the open beta okay, test. Okay, beta test. It's kind of great. Okay, the power of each exosuit for yourself as your team faces off against a wall of dinosaurs in Dino Survival, the game's main mode. Participants in the open beta test who fill out a survey will also receive an IBS metal charm that can be used in the full game. Please visit the official site for beta test timing, content, and bonus item info. Now I'd like to introduce the Survival Pass reward system. Now it's time to the time to the time as both. Acquire what? Where the pass, pass with the their Survival Pass level goes up. 
and they earn rewards separate from player and suit levels. The Survival Pass includes a free tier and a paid premium tier. Purchasing the premium tier unlocks access to special rewards, including 19 exosuit skins and 10 weapon skins. Here are some of the rewards. The Deluxe Edition includes the Survival Pass Season 1 premium tier as an added limited time bonus. So, go back there, ha ha. The premium tier at the Pirate Pass. Exo Primal launches July 14, 2023. Pre-order bonuses are and also bonus. available. And other quick oh boy. Please see the official site for details on bonus items and the game. The latest Exo Primal news can be found on the official website and social media. We'll have more for you soon. Okay, data pass. Jay, my day team. So yeah. All right. Use your powers of the dead to uncover the truth about your death. Next day is so quick. Ghost Trick, the classic mystery game from Ace Attorney creator Shu Takumi, is being reborn. The game will release on June 30th, 2023. One night in a dark corner of the city, a man named Sissel is shot and killed. He reawakens as a soul and realizes he's lost his memory and his life. Why are you at the end? Who was I? Who killed me? And why did I have to die? These are the mysteries he's trying to solve with the powers of the dead. Sizzle has two basic abilities, possessing objects in the ghost world, and then tricking them in the real world. A hitman is after the red-headed target, Lynn. Use the powers of the dead to get her out of wild predicaments. The key to changing fate is possessing and tricking all sorts of objects. Sizzle will face death in many forms. Use the powers of the dead to go back four minutes before someone's death. Changing their fate will change the story. And that story must be linked in some way to the mystery of Sissel's death. This board includes updated high-res graphics, increased frame rate, and an optimized user interface. Check out the new challenges feature. You can earn illustrations and use it. In addition, all 37 tracks from the game have newly arranged versions. You can switch between the original and new versions as you play. Hello everyone, I'm Shu Takumi, the writer and director of the original Ghost Trick game. We're thrilled to share the release date with you all. I'm incredibly excited to revisit Ghost Trick. We had Yasumasa Kitagawa by Crater Fire to the Red Cube. Started to turn my head. We had Crater with Matt Greta Tato, Master New Crocker. All we had a good feeling about after the Bay College to the Crocker and the New Fantasy Day. Hope you don't the new dog. The story of lost lives and lost memory all in a single night. Ghost Trick will oh. be reborn in high resolution with new music on June 30th, 2023 for Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Steam. Pre-orders are now available. Check out the official website. Oh, it's oh, anyway. Please stay tuned. And you ha 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 And we got a new view face Oh, alright, Mario Hunter Y Your hunting spirit on even more platforms Monster Hunter Rise is now available for Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S 
Xbox One, Windows, PlayStation 5, and PlayStation. Please watch this video with information about the latest promotions. Okay. What the what what the? This is our app. Uh, uh, hi. Okay. We got that new queen over bombing. The massive expansion Monster Hunter Bro, Rise of the kind of next month on April 28, 2023. You can look forward to a host of new features, including new monsters, locales, and combat mechanics, in addition to memorable new characters and storylines. The expansion includes the free title updates up to free title update 3, giving you instant access to chaotic Gormagala and other powerful monsters. We'll have information about future updates at a later title we updates are also Fast available Nintendo for Monster Hunter Steam. Rise Sunbreak for Nintendo Switch and Steam. Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak digital event in April to share the latest information about the next free title update 5. Next we Moving on to our to... next topic, we have news about the Resident Evil series. Make a way here. Evo, get out here! That's a twenty twenty three. So, hey, anime. Share this new preview with you all. You may uh, have wait. Hey, anime, a new thing. Brief appearance at the end of the video. Resident Evil, Evil Death Island will release this summer. Let's do what you are. 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 Let's we're grateful for all of the okay. R4 fans who are excited for the game. Oh! Game. This game is a real oh. the original. Do everything the Wedded Bay Evil movie! Hmm? It takes place in six oh. years. Oh! 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 It's the Wedded Bay Evil movie! Agent Leon S. Kennedy as he fights mm -hmm. to survive. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, it's a very evil movie. Preserve the core of the original game and added updated graphics and a reimagined storyline. Oh, I thought it was a good game. Oh, crap, 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 just around the corner. But we have a special announcement prepared for you today. Please check out this video. But my friend, why he did already check it out? But my friend, already why? Um, I am my friend, already on the way to why he watches the wet in that to do mowing. So, the wait is over. 
So, as the week after, after we watch the rest of the other, uh, uh, my queen, it takes place in the beginning of the game. As mm. Leon we go wait my queen day in. He also already go rest. So we to break the table down. The platform supported our PlayStation 5 and PlayStation 4, as well as Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S and Steam. We hope you enjoy trying a portion of this reimagined survival horror. Resident Evil 4 is currently available for order. We follow for what you follow it anyway. The standard edition and the deluxe edition include pre-order bonuses. Be sure to check them out. There's not long until the March 24th release date. Okay. Please enjoy the trial. It has to be about what it has a minute. Thank you one, for watching today. Two. Three. I, oh, one. Two. 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 Two weeks die the mall. Two weeks by the mall. Get quiet. If 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 we have the two weeks by the mall. And finally, and why has to cross his midnight mark ten? It's the third time. A rescue, a rescue was the one in the big game. Green is the crowd midnight. Why? Ah. Why? That's all for our event today. Thanks for watching. And that is all for my why you watched and all your owning. I will watch the neighborhood day to buy. Thanks for watching. See you next time. And yes, I will see you next time. <laughs> and yes, I will see you next time. Bye for now. Mm -mm. Pick away my queen, day in. Who wants you to wet? To do. So, I will watch the wet with you die. And, and, but, you are the my watch the wet to then. Already in quarter. Don't do it for him, right? <laughs> so anyway, to go away, my friend. But I can die for the second second you and end up by by down on the green. By by down by I die for the second second you oh yeah. Bye. Yeah. So hopefully I will try to walk back to queen. Tomorrow, to put away my friend. But anyway, this is that to go away him right now. I did ten ten yards away, Mackin. For him in the way, Mackin. But Mister, did I did I run away? With that, I will see you next time. Take care. Have a good one. And then for my Bawasi and victory. I do then. I do me then. They go. Did it, you kitty? Ow. See you next time. What the? Hmm.